Now, don't get me wrong, I'll never get rid of my Cadillac, but for days like this, you really need one of those old rag tops. See the USA in your Chevrolet. America is asking you to call. Drive your Chevrolet through the USA. Now, the best place to find these classic convertibles is up at Neil Martin's Goldenrod Garage. If he doesn't have it, they didn't make it. Today's specials? A little 64 Chevelle Super Sport with a four-speed for 9,500. Or a little more elegance, uh, a 60 T-Bird for 10,5. Um, uh, my only problem is I got about, I got about 2,500 bucks. 2,500? We better go to the wise guide. Wise guide, wise guide. All right. 7,500. You wouldn't take anything lower, say maybe 2,500, would you? We checked a whole bunch of leads, but there wasn't anything in my price range. Then, okay. just as we were about to All call right. it quits, right, bingo. 75 Buick convertible, new motor, no rust, 2595. Did someone say deal? Well, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Turns out the car's owned by Ray and Tina Ellsworth. They only drive it on sunny afternoons in late August, and yes, it's killing them to let the darn thing go. Hmm. But aren't you going to be sad to see this yes, car go? Yes, I, I was hoping that you would not want it. <laughs> After the opening pleasantries, we went for the all-important test drive. Well, Bob, his uh, comments about its southern heritage and rust-free condition appear to be accurate. Sounds real nice and smooth. It uh, doesn't have any knocks or rumblings down inside. Big engine. I don't want to tell him this. I'd pay $25.95. Do I tell him that? Well, I think, quite frankly, the car is fully worth $25.95. But in the true Yankee spirit, I think we ought to come back and make some sort of a counter offer and uh, see how firm he is. But I don't think you ought to walk away from this one. Do you folks have any ability to demonstrate some flexibility in that price at all? Not a penny. Not a dime? Not even a penny. Not enough so Bob can take me out and buy me a couple of beers for my time? I, I might... I'll buy you a beer. Turns out they did drop the price from $25.95 to $25.73, because that's all the money I had. All right. I'd like to see the green stuff. OK. Well, that's it. From now on, I'll be cruising in style, topless. Sure, it cost me $2,573, but who cares? Right now, I feel like a million bucks.